How are you doing? Today we are going to talk about vectors cross product. So I'll share my screen with you. The cross product of two vectors problem is u is a vector minus 2i plus 4j, v is another vector 3i plus 2j plus 5k. Uh, first part we have to find u cross v, second part v cross u, and the third part v cross v. So in order to find u cross v, we write it as a determinant i, j, and k in the first row, and in the second row, the coefficients of i, j, and k in u, which is minus two, four, and there is no k, so it is zero for the coefficient of k. And for the third row, it is the coefficient of v, three, two, and five, or the directional numbers. And uh, in order to find the determinant of this uh, uh, three row by three column, first we do, first we eliminate the first row and the first column. So i, j, k from the first row are gone and i minus two, three from the first column are gone. So what are we left with? Four, zero, and two, five. Um, this goes with i. The next one is negative, always negative, the second one. And now we eliminate the first row and the second column. So i, j, k, and j, four, two are gone. So we are left with minus two, three, and zero, five, j. Okay. And to get the coefficient of k, it is always positive. And then we eliminate the first row and the third column. So i, j, k, and k, zero, five are gone. So we are left with minus two, four, and three, two. Now we have to find this determinant, two rows by two columns. It's easy. So we, for the first one, it is four times five multiply across 20 minus two times zero is zero. In parenthesis, that's the coefficient of i minus uh, for j minus two times five is minus 10 and then minus zero times zero is zero. Plus for k, the coefficient is minus two times two is minus four. Then minus four times three is minus 12. So the final answer is 20i plus 10j, because two minuses make it positive, plus 10j minus 16k. Now we have to find v cross u. Okay, so we write i, j, k in the first row. In the second row, we write the coefficients of v, because v is first, so which is 3, 2, and 5. And at the third row, we write the coefficients of u vector, which is minus two and four, and I think for k, so it is zero. Then, like before, we first eliminate the first row and first column, we are left with two, five, four, zero for i, and then negative, eliminate the first row and the second column, we are left with three minus two and five, zero. And for the coefficient of k, eliminate the first row and the third column, left with three, two, and minus two, four, okay? So we have two times zero is zero minus 20, four times five. There's a coefficient of i minus three times zero is zero minus minus, two minuses will make it plus, two times five is 10j. And then for k it is three times four, 12 minus minus, two times two minus minus plus, it plus 12 plus four is 16. So it's minus 20i, minus 10j and plus 16k. Now v cross v. So i, j, k in the first row, then three, two, five coefficients of uh, v, and again coefficient of v in the third row. And then eliminate the first row, first column, you're left with two, five, two, five for i. Then eliminate the first row and the second column, three, three, and five, five. And for k, eliminate the first row and the third column left with three, two, three, two. So two times five is 10 minus 10. Two times five across, then two times five across 10. Then three times five, 15 minus 15, j. Plus three times two, two minus three times two, six minus six. So everything is zero. So the answer for v cross v is zero. 
So I will stop here today. If you have any question, please write me a comment and please subscribe to my channel. <coughs> I come back every week with new problem, new solution. See you next time. Thanks for watching. Take care.